is risen. Christus was crescent. Who is Christus was crest. Who is Christus and Esti. Only Thomas and Esti. Thomas here come. Ah, come, come. Christus and Viat. Christus and Jav. Christus and Jav. Christ is risen. Indubitably, he is risen. Brothers and sisters in Christ, it is a great joy to be with you here this morning as we celebrate this wonderful and holy, glorious gospel of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, who is risen from the dead, who by his death trampled down death. Uh, and grants life eternal to us as well. It is a joy to be with you as we hear this great gospel in so many different languages. As we uh, remember God's love for us, let us also remember our love for each other. As we embrace God here on this holy day that he has embraced us in his death and resurrection, let us embrace each other. As we uh, seek to live in obedience to him, let us love one another. Uh, may we indeed hear and embrace the very word of God. May we love God in all that he says and does for us and hear and obey his holy commandments and his gospel uh, that he has given to us this day. Uh, may we indeed rejoice, whether we waited until last night to come, whether we waited until today to come. Let us arise each new day embracing the love that he has for us and embracing uh, each other and embracing the very way that he has given to us to live as his disciples. Yesterday we heard the great gospel, therefore go to his apostles, therefore go and make disciples of all nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, and teaching them to obey all these things that I have commanded you. Let us indeed in humility and obedience Follow our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ. Let us take up our crosses uh, that we might deny ourselves and follow him who bore his cross for us uh, and for the life of the world. Let us then live in the resurrection that he has granted to us, he who raised himself from the dead and also will raise us from the dead. Dearest, beloved children of God, let us rejoice and be thankful to God. Let us rejoice, for this is indeed the day that the Lord has made. Therefore, let us rejoice and be glad therein. Christ is risen. Indubitably, he is risen. Christos and Esti. Amitos and Esti. Thomas here come. Hachat come. Christos was crazy. Christos was crazy. Christos and Viat. Vertat and Viat. Christi and Jav. Vertat and Jav. Christos and Sustato. Christos was crazy. Christ is risen. Indubitably, he is risen. Glory to his holy third day resurrection. We adore his holy third day resurrection. Christ is risen. Indubitably, he is risen. Here come. Ah, come, come. Christos and Viat. Vertat and Viat. Vertat and Jav. Christos was crest. Christ is risen. Indubitably, he is risen. Christ is risen. Indubitably, he is risen. Christ is risen. Indubitably, he is risen. We adore his third day resurrection. Dearest ones, a joy to be with you all here this glorious and great Holy Pascha. May you have a wonderful and great and bright and glorious day and week. We will have Vespers again on Wednesday night, a very much similar to tonight without the procession and the gospel. Uh, we'll have liturgy, a Pascha liturgy on Thursday morning at 9 o'clock as well. If you weren't able to come last night, uh, if it's because your kids were asleep and you couldn't get them over here, for whatever reason, it's because you were asleep and you couldn't get over here. Come on Thursday for liturgy, for a Paschal liturgy as well. Come on Sunday for Paschal and Resurrection uh, liturgy every Sunday. Uh, dear ones, especially dear ones with little children, uh, your little children are the greatest gift that God could ever give you. Take care of them. Raise them in the way of the Lord. I encourage you, especially at this time, uh, when the world around us, when the society around us is trying to tear our children and us away from God, away from his holy church, away from life with him, in full joy and radiance and love, especially at this time, dear ones, bring your children to church, raise them in the way of the Lord. I know it is difficult. I brought many of them. <laughs> I know it is hard, uh, but dear ones, the reward is eternal. It is eternal for you and for them. Uh, so bring them in love. Bring them in love of God, in love of them. Uh, bring them to embrace 
the very faith that was given to you and has been handed down from generation to generation from the apostles, from Christ himself, and through the apostles and through his holy church. Bring us, dear ones, and bring yourself. God bless you all. Christ is risen. Amen.